Hey y'all, it's Robert. It's May the 11th, and here's my update for today. Um, didn't really get a lot done. Um, I just, you know, had to do other things, and I, I didn't have a lot of time for painting. But I'll show you what I did do. Um, I tried putting that highlight of um, Game Color Leather Brown on, and it's, it's only slightly um, lighter than the... Um, English uniform that I had put on here um, before, and I don't know. It's it. I guess it worked out, but it, it's a very, very subtle highlight. Um, but the other thing I did was uh, I painted the straps that hold on the leggings in two colors. Um, half of them have red, and half of them have blue, and that's just purely a uh, game concern. You know, just to have some way to tell at a glance which squad um, these guys would be in and you know I, I have no idea what colors those leg straps would be they maybe they just be um, leather straps too or probably just some random piece of, piece of cloth they use to, to tie around their legs actually but uh, anyhow um, I'm done with the uh, pretty much with the lower half of all these models and I think tomorrow I'm gonna work on um, painting the uh, the straps and the backpacks and you know canteens and whatnot um, but I don't know if I'll get a lot of work done tomorrow either for that matter um, anyhow question of the day is what movie would you like to see a sequel or remake of um, I thought about that for a bit and I finally decided I'd like to see a, um, a sequel to um, Master and Commander with um, Russell Crowe and Paul Bettany. That's the one where uh, Russell Crowe is Jack Aubrey and he's a Napoleonic ship captain, you know, and he sails around uh, South America chasing after a French frigate. But uh, anyhow, I'm a fan of those novels by Patrick O'Brien and um, I'd just like to see another one. It, you know, it might be kind of tough since. The uh, first movie was actually just kind of an amalgamation of several of the novels. But, you know, I guess they could do that with a, a sequel, too. And, uh, you know, there's like 20 of those novels, so I'm sure there's a lot that they can mix together and make one good movie. Alright, um, that's it for me, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.